Welcome to the 7th Artivist Film Festival dedicated to creating awareness for humanity, animals, and the environment through international films. Now during the past seven years, the Artivist Film Festival has screened more than 400 films from all over the world. We just finished watching How Weed Won the West. We're going to get audience reactions, so stay tuned. Hi. So how'd you like it? Did you like it? Well, I loved it. It was a great experience because it sheds a light on the ignorance of you know general populations such as myself. And um, why not legalize? You know, it's just like if the FDA controlled the, the little pills, the other drugs. You know, those pills can make people crazy, paranoid, and kill people. So what's the difference? The difference is the government is not taking a big chunk of money. Hypocrites. That's what they are. You know what I'm saying? So yeah, I loved it. Yeah. I'm really happy that I came, actually. It was good. It was very, yeah. very, very, very informative. Okay. It was good. Thank you. Hi, hey, what did you think of the film? It was great. Very enjoyable. It was well done, and it was written pretty much in line with my views. It was very good. It was very informative. I think people need to understand what this whole issue is about with regards to medical marijuana and the growing and the need to have some regulation, but at the same time make sure that people who need this medicine are allowed to have access to it. What do you think about the legalization of marijuana? I'm for it, to be honest. Yeah. Should have been legal a long time ago. Okay. That's all. Actually, I'm president of Kern County Normal, the national organization for reform of marijuana laws, and I'm starting Clemency, California to release medical marijuana patients from jail. And uh, I'm glad Prop 19 didn't pass. It needs to stay medical marijuana. Medical marijuana can help 89% of the population. The other 11% that don't qualify for it, they probably don't want it anyways. So, I don't know, I'm shy. <laughs> okay. I've been growing marijuana for about 35 years now. And basically I'm a Vietnam veteran. The VA has okayed me to use my medical marijuana and I think everybody should just smoke one. Uh, it was a great film. I thought uh, it presented uh, you know, a lot of good topics in there. I think they should roll up one at the UN and maybe they could sit down and have some peaceful conversation. How do you feel about the legalization of marijuana? Um, well, I believe in the medicinal benefits of the, of the plant. And after the stories I've heard of people getting off uh, cancer patients who don't, you know, need to eat eight, ten different pharmaceutical pills a day, um, and they use just the medicinal uh, benefits of the plant. I think it's amazing. Why can't we all get along? We're stuck on a piece of dirt in the middle of space. It's www.leavesofgrass.info. You can read the government's U.S. patent there that talks about the neuroprotectants and everything else that the plant does, and um, it's just really, it's it's not about getting high, like Brett said. It's about using the medicinal benefits of the plant. I definitely feel motivated to play my part in helping to make marijuana legal in California and then spreading that to the rest of the country. People worry about things too much. This isn't a dress rehearsal, and we need, we're walking our lives under people's thumbs. And what gives them that right? Just because they have more money? Plus, I'm from Brazil, and Petrobras is the sponsor, so, you know, yes. I had to be here. You know, Petrobras uh, really put on this whole event for us, so can you say thank you to us? Well, thank you very much, and by the way, back in Brazil, my first car was ethanol car. See, I support you guys from, like, 15 years back. <laughs> yeah. So it was great. I'm going to be here to, uh, tomorrow and Saturday for the closing night. Yeah, great. I'm really excited. Thank you. Though. Thank you.